Right guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing a quick review on these mini binoculars. Now I got these for, I think it was like £5. Some of them you can get them for like £10, £5. It depends what deal is going. But as you can see, it comes in this little sneak looking pouch. And, you know, it's got a belt loop on the back if you want to put it on the belt. But your belt needs to be quite slim in order to use this belt loop. If you wanted to use it with a thicker belt, then you would have to, you know, sew an additional strap or something onto there. Anyway, let's unbox it. So when you take it out of its packaging, you will see that it will look something like this. Now, let me just slide it out. Now, let me move it over there. Now, as you can see, it does look quite cool, doesn't, doesn't it? I mean, look at the size of it. If I put them to my eyes, then we can see that they are pretty cool. And they also come with this uh, neck strap, which we can see here. Now, one of the things what I have noticed with these uh, mini binoculars is that you can have a ghosting effect. So have a look at this. See the way the image looks like a ghosting effect? So it looks like you've got like two birds there. Well, that's what happens if you do not use these uh, binoculars and set them up correctly. So. I've noticed that, you know, once you've got them set up correctly and then you look through them again, then you won't have any ghosting and you'll actually see a very sharp looking image. But these binoculars, how they work right, is fire this little dial here and also fire a twist up here. And what it does is, uh, it, 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 it's quite special. Quite strange, I've never actually done this before, but what they want you to do, okay, is they want you to adjust the distance, and then they want you to close one eye, put it up, and then use this little thing to adjust and focus on the left eye. And then what they want is you to close your left eye, bring them up, and then use this side here to adjust the focus for the right eye. And what I've noticed is that the left eye focuses at short distance and the right eye focuses at long distances. So when you combine these two, you know, images together, you will get one sharp image from the front all the way to the back. So that is why it asks you to basically focus the left eye with this section and the right eye with this section. So as you can see, it sounds a bit weird, but nonetheless, it actually does work. And guys, as you can see, they're very small looking binoculars. And you know, I am really, really impressed because again, you have a neck strap and the light is anything, they take up no room. The dead cheap, you can get them for five pound to uh, 10 pound on the internet. United States dollars, that's about eight dollars up to 15 dollars, something like that. But yeah, you know, they really do see into the horizon. You'll get your instructions with these binoculars, again, to show you how you set them up. Because again, this, this section here is just for the left eye, and this section here adjusts for the right eye. I think every, you know, uh, hiker, wild camper, etc., should really carry these binoculars, particularly if you're map reading, because this really does help you see into the distance in order to, you know, find landmarks or waypoints, etc., particularly when you're map reading. But yeah, guys. For the money, you cannot beat these little binoculars. Well worth investment, and I will be taking them everywhere with me when I go hiking and wild camping. Right, see you all in the next video.